control with these, you know, these controls. I mean, I know it's easier in handheld mode, but still, bro. I need to put it in this kind of, you know, control thing anyway, considering I can't do it on the actual system. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Before we get into this episode, I want to warn you guys that this is actually going to be the season finale of season four, only because of one thing. In three days, Kirby Star Allies is going to get updated again for our second DLC characters. Now, because of this, I'm actually going to save the rest of World 4 for later and come back when Season 5 gets released. That's until July 28th comes. So, for now, welcome to the Season Finale of Season 4 in the Kirby Star Allies gameplay series. In the last video, as many of you might have expected, we took on Grot Moon and finally completed it. So it's now time to move on to World 4-7, Planet Frosty. Let's get to it! Now, because I got Man Knight and Bandana Wild D back with me, yeah, that's why I'm saving this as the last episode of Season 4. Now, don't worry, I am going to come back into this later to start up Season 4, just not right now, considering this is going to be the season finale of Season 4. So, keep in mind, the next episode after this will be, of course, the beginning of Season 5. That's after the update video of the second DLC pack character comes in next. So, that's how this is going to work. And regardless of that, yeah. Like that chili after even getting him as a friend. Oh, that's messed up. But he did a waddle dee. What are you doing? He's just sliding around the ice instead of getting the ability. What the heck actually is that, bro? No, I need you out of my face. Give him Blizzard. Thank you. Man, and I, if you would. Thank you. Come on, let's get him. What the heck he was doing, bro? Oh. Okay, I need Cutter for this. As much as I like staff, I can't use the ability, unfortunately, because this requires the, um, you know, Cutter anyway. Got it! That was pretty straightforward. I'll take all of that. I need to heal you. Now let the, the ice team carry on! Get it? Because we're all happy. We all have Blizzard. That's the joke. Never mind. That was a pretty rotten joke, anyway. Oh heck no! Jesus, Louise is. It's hard to control with these, you know, these controls. I mean, I know it's easier in handheld mode, but still, bro, I need to put it in this kind of, you know, control thing anyway. Considering I can't do it on the actual system, otherwise you guys wouldn't be able to see any of this. Bro. Excuse me? Heck no. Bye bye. I was gonna shit that thing out of my face. Oh my god! Almost fell off! Like I said, bro, it's better in handheld mode than this, and I can't do it in handheld mode anyway, considering. You cannot be freaking serious. Ugh. I have to get covered all over again because. Not the big of a deal. Because I already gave everyone else Blizzard anyway, so it wouldn't even matter. Heck no. You get out of my face. Alright, now we can get in here. I assume it's for something. And of course, we need to have this anyway. What the heck is that? Come on, Kirby, do better. There we go. I meant to do that last time, and apparently I couldn't get it the first time through. Oh, the big switch! Almost skipped this. That leads us to yet another extra stage. Okay, I'll gladly take that more than anything. I'm still trying to focus on that rainbow piece too, but still, bro. That's more rewarding than anything. Man, I don't think it's necessary to, to freeze that water nucleus off the beginning. Now this one, on the other hand, it is necessary. Okay, you get out of my face. That includes you too. I'm, as much as I like you, Bl Burden, I don't actually need you on the team for now. I'm rocking with Chili right now. Considering I still have Meta Knight and Banana Wild, he's still on the team, you know. Get out of my face. Heck freaking no! Not about to deal with a stupid Glunk. Freaking hate Glunks, you know. That's the first. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Well, at least take that more than anything. Get out of my face. Of these glungs am I gonna see? Like, get that garbage out my face, bro. 
I know they're good enemies, but that doesn't mean you have to shove every single clunk in front of my face, bro. But... I mean, granted, I hate clunks, okay? From the beginning, I played through the first game and, you know, saw those clunks. I was just like, oh, crap. I knew right away I was getting this. I mean, what are you doing? Okay, well, at least I got all over here, but we're still not at the end of the stage yet. Only because we're not at the end of the stage. What do you expect? First of all, I need to get rid of you. I was trying to get rid of that bile spark, and apparently that ended up happening. Goodness, bro. You get out of my face. Careful. Come on, bro. What is wrong with me in these controls? Sorry about that music in the background, guys. Jeez. There we go, finally. How did I still get hit? You know what, I think it could be because of the crate. I think it might be because of the crate. I could be wrong with that statement, but still. I still do not know how I got hit by that crate regardless. With that enemy. How does it get rid of one at a time? What the heck actually is that, bro? I mean, granted, I guess it's kind of useful for getting rid of all these chains, but... I guess I kind of did need to have um, Ninja anyway, but I just didn't think it would be necessary because of the fact that Ninja's not... I'm gonna be honest, Ninja's not actually a good ability. I mean, I do like the ability, sure, but it's kind of hard to control it with these kinds of controls. So, you know, not, not the most useful ability. Just in my opinion anyway, considering that I already, you know, have Cutter with me, so what's the point? I mean, even if I did get Ninja, I would have got it anyway, but still, I just... I'm more of a fan of Cutter just because of the fact that Cutter's just a good ability. I mean, sure my most favorite ability in the game by far is Hammer, but you know, Cutter 2 is also a neat ability to use if you know what you're doing with it. Just not in this kind of case, no. Okay, glad they take that ice cream. You guys look like you need to have some healing. What are you doing? You're just a burning Leo! Jesus! Oh, crud, no. Okay, you get out of my face, you get out of my face. I said for you to get out of my face, not just stand there. That, that guy's a little bit of all this stuff. Or not, because my Dano Wild E just killed him. Such a disrespect. I was trying to get rid of him too, until he just completely just backfired me. Ah, whatever. At least we made it to the end of the stage. So that's the only positive I got from this. Hey, bro, that was some insane stuff going about. I'll take it regardless. Besides, we made it to the end of the stage anyway, so it wouldn't even matter. At least I got it too, though. Alright, that gladly takes care of that. I'll gladly appreciate that. Oh, and sorry about that music in the background. It was from my, um... It, I didn't put that music in there on purpose. It's because someone was trying to, you know, fix up something, but not important for now. And well, I'll take that rainbow piece too. And with that, takes care of that. Now, I'm not going to actually head into the boss stage for this episode because, like I mentioned, yeah, we also unlocked Extra Planet B. There's more venture to be found. Extra stage just has been unlocked. So, with that, that gladly takes care of World 4 7. So, that's going to wrap things up for Season 4, and it now comes to an end. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, but don't worry, this is not the end of the Kirby Star Allies series just yet. The reason why this is the season finale of Season 4, as I mentioned, is because of the fact that I'm saving this for Season 5 coming up. Only because of the fact there is a new DLC pack coming up in 3 days. I'm very excited for that new DLC pack. But in any case guys, I'll meet you guys back when I come back for Episode 1 of Season 5. So I'll meet you guys next time.